Hey guys, this is for U.S. History. It's a, we're still doing the Lincoln assassination. Um, there are there's a, a couple of pages here with a, a bunch of paragraphs with question after each paragraph. Um, so I'm going to read a few few of them and then uh, you can do the rest. So Civil War period of American history is arguably some of the darkest days for the people of the United States. Americans fought and killed each other for five long years as the southern states attempted to leave the Union and form their own country. The United States government was finally successful in ending the rebellion in 1865, but the victory came at a terrible price. It was during this time period we U.S. lost the only man who could successfully heal the wounds caused by the war when Abraham Lincoln was assassinated. There's a question for that paragraph, and it's what had happened to the United States that greatly weakened it during the Civil War period. There's a small box here. It says, in April of 1865, Robert E. Lee surrendered his army to Ulysses S. Grant in Appomattox Courthouse. The war was over, and the southern states had to return to the U.S.-controlled government. And it says, why are these government officials doing this to the Confederate flag, and why? And you'll see there's a picture there. Uh, let's see. All right, so next paragraph says, When it became clear the Union was going to win the war, Lincoln began meeting with members of the Congress to decide how to deal with the defeated South Southern politicians and military leaders. Many of the members of Congress were furious with Southern to try to secede, and they wanted to convict them of treason and punish them as traitors with a de death penalty. Lincoln disagreed and thought that it would be best way to end the war for good was to let the Southern states back in the Union with as little drama as possible. Lincoln was afraid that if they treated the South too harshly, they would rise up in rebellion again, and that would be something that he truly wished to avoid. There's another question with a picture after that. And the last paragraph I'm going to read for you. Uh, Lincoln and his supporters successfully set up a program where the Southern states would have free, freed all their slaves and agreed to pr protect their civil rights before they were allowed to be obtained statehood again. This system allowed the government to guarantee the safety and freedom of slaves even after Lincoln had left office. The statehood program made the slaves and radical Republicans happy, but it severely upset all the racist Southern politicians who needed slavery to keep their economies intact. The Wade Davis bill was the law that allowed the Southern states to re-enter the Union without being accused of treason. According to this image, so there's an image on the left, uh, what else did the Southerners have to do besides free their slaves before they were allowed to let the people back in. Uh, to look at these images, you might have to um, uh, zoom in a little bit to get a better idea of what's going on. They are small on the page, but use the zoom button on the bottom right hand of uh, your um, window. Okay. Uh, remember to fill out the attendance sheet. Also remember we're coming down to the end here. June 5th will be the last day for new work, and that will be a makeup period after that. All right. So I will see you tomorrow.